Now the question is that if all the factors of 240 are written in increasing order, then we have to find that which factor will occupy the 16th position, right? So to understand this question in a far better way, let us uh, take a very small number. Suppose if I take a number say uh, 20, right? So we can write all the factors of 20 like 1, 2, then 4, then it will be 5, then it will be 10 and then it will be 20, right? So here 20 has six, six number of factors, right? We can also find out the number of factors of 20. So 20 can be written as two square into five. So the number of factors will be three into two, which is six, right? Two is here. So two will be corresponding to three. That is two plus one. And the power of five is one here. So this one will correspond to one plus one. That is equal to two. So six is the total number of factors. And we have listed all those factors. So the, the factor one will occupy the first position the factor 2 is occupying the second position, the factor th you know, 4 is occupying third, this is occupying fourth, and this is occupying fifth position, and this is occupying the last position, right? Now, the interesting thing to note here is that if I take the product of first and the sixth uh, or the last uh, factor, then the product is the number itself, right? Similarly, if I take the second and the second last, again, the product is the number itself and third and the third last again the product is the number itself. So this logic will also follow for the number 240 right. So 240 first of all let us understand how many factor it has. So 240 when I factorize so it will be 2 to the power 4 into 3 into 5 right. So the number of factors will be 4 plus 1 into 2, 1 plus 1 that will be 2 and 1 plus 1 which comes out to be 5 into 2 into 2 or 20. So uh, 240 has 20 factors. Definitely if I want to list all those factors in increasing order, the number 1 will occupy the first position, number 2 will occupy the third, uh, second, 3 is also the factor will which will occupy the third position so and so forth and the last factor will be 240. So this will occupy the 20th position and this will occupy the first position, right? And we know that the product of these two will give me the number 240 itself. Now we need to find the, uh, the number which occupies 16th position, right? Now if I add the position number first plus 20th, so position number is 21. Similarly, if I had taken the second and the 19th position number then again the sum of the position number would have been 21 so suppose say x is the position x is the factor which is in the 16th position so 16 will go with the number which is at the fifth position right because 5 plus 16 is 21 now it is very easy to identify which factor will come in the fifth position so 1 2 3 and 4 will also be the factor and 5 is also the factor so it's easy to uh, find out that number 5 will be the fifth will occupy the fifth position when all the factors are listed uh, uh, listed right so uh, the product of 5 into x must be equal to 240 or we can say that the value of x would be 240 divided by 5 which is 48 so this is the answer